Interesting table which we are going to show you about UNESCO. That means the uh, attitude to Israel. Now this is their sign, yeah, this is the sign of UNESCO, it is known, the symbol of UNESCO. And unfortunately clearly showing hatred to Israel. So let us see now what the table that we were looking for shows. So we were looking definitely for UNESCO, as you can see UNESCO coming here, definitely connected to the AUM, to the United Nations, part of it, the organization of it. And then what we wanted to see more, definitely what really happened and who were the nations that supported. Now the first time was the Palestinians because they were those who were really initiated this assembly which brought to this decision that Israel had no connection to the holy places in Jerusalem, then Egypt, which is a little bit boring, because the nation that Israel connected with is perhaps more boring, is Russia, Russia, which we have here because the connection with Russia, but once Russia shows this attitude to Israel, which really, no doubt, far away from reality, showing that Israel has no connection to Jerusalem, to the Temple Mount, so very, very dangerous. And then China also, Israel has quite good connection with them, China. So altogether, this is definitely worrying, but what is really the most interesting is, as we say, that UNESCO is really the haters of Israel. And then, who are those, or are they, the loving of the Arabs, it means the Arab countries, you see it clearly. Most of these states were the Arabs, but those who supported them also had interest to show love to the Arabs, politically. It was important for them, very lucky. This is the year, Tavshin 9 Vav, last year, 776, where really the UNESCO decided about it, and then now came out with this decision in the, in the state. Now, so looking all together, the location in the Torah, this is the most interesting that we have here fighting with the Amalekite. Now, Amalekite is not only a nation who fight with Israel physically, but really spiritual forces, also Jews, come to the Zohar, Erebrav, Jews themselves, which belong to the left, small and as we see today, the Tselim and Shalom Achshav, people really are unfortunately hating Jews, I mean, Orthodox, the Torah, because the Torah says that Israel belongs to the, to the Jews. So definitely those who are fighting against this have to do with them, because this resource is in different places. So amazing, you have really the place fighting with the Melech, and but the most important is this verse. Which tells us that in this war, in this fighting, Vayakashe Yarim Moshe Adov Gavar Israel, Moshe lifted up his hand, Israel was winning, Vikashe Ania Yadov and he brought his hand down, the Amalekites. So definitely the question why did he not leave his hand all the time? So our rabbis tell us this was dependent on the Jews, when they have strong faith in God up in heaven, then the hands of Moses were up. But when Jews unfortunately lost their faith in heaven, the Torah, then the hands of Moses came down. So very important teaching for our time that only by the belief in the Torah, and keeping the Torah, the Sabbath, definitely, properly, as it should be, this is the only way to fight against these evil forces, unfortunately, in Mexico, all the others who want to destroy Israel, physically, spiritually. So, important message before the time of Sukkot, which is the time of Gogo Magog. And Gogo Magog is written in books. Not only is a physical war, it is spiritual war, which we seek to lay clearly what is going on against Israel. So, important table, which really, as we said, includes very important words relevant
ביצוע ההוצאה.